invasive species? Well, now that sounds like something right out of a science fiction movie. But what does that term actually mean? Well, typically invasive species are animals and plants that start to grow or reproduce to the point where they threaten our natural resources. Anything invasive can be a problem. However, the invasive species that we're talking about are specifically invasive plants that are non-native or don't belong in Florida. They are brought to Florida from different places and introduced into our ecosystem. Right now, more than 30% of all our plants in Florida are non-native. Here are a couple of invasive plants which are non-native and are the most threatening to our environment. Now, they might not look scary, but once they're here, they sure cause scary things to happen to our waterways, the same waterways that the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers is responsible for managing and protecting. This little invader is called the water hyacinth, and this one is called water lettuce. Now, what these plants do best is multiply. Water hyacinth is so good at it that within 14 days, it can double its population. And in a single growing season, can spread and cover an area about the size of a football field. Aquatic invasive plants can clog our rivers and canals. Now imagine trying to get anywhere in a boat or kayak. What a mess. Even worse, these invaders act like a barrier between the water and air. This prevents oxygen from circulating through the water. It also blocks the sunlight. Florida's ecosystem rocks. That's why the Army Corps of Engineers and its partners work hard to help protect, manage, and maintain our waterways. And by keeping the effects of these invaders under control, you'll be able to appreciate the environment just the way nature intended.